So this is still Money. kind of left over from the uh, the building period. So don't worry too much about this starting area. Uh, but essentially, the rules are you are you are in adventure mode, are you not? Um, I can be. Uh, <laughs> There's a button behind you. If you're not in adventure mode, you should be. I hope I am now. Okay, you should be. You should be in adventure mode. Um, and yeah, you'd have to try to complete all the challenges. Some of them had some issues, and so I'm here to kind of let you know when something's not completable and we'll just skip past it. Um, but okay. Basically, you've, you've got an hour to complete all of the challenges and potentially find all five of the... There are five items, so there should be five challenges. And if you hit an hour, then that means they have made the challenges too hard for us very casual players, and they will be disqualified, and they will get a zero from you. Okay, I am ready. All right, three, two, one, go! Yay! Oops. And I'm going to jump into spectator mode and follow you around and try not to <laughs> interfere. It's dangerous to go alone, so take a xylophone. Okay. <laughs> That's the first okay. item. I'm going to try really hard not to say anything. <laughs> yeah, don't say anything. I, 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 um... Okay. I'm guessing I follow the path. So I'm going to follow the path. Of the... Well, there's more than one path. Once orange you complete both red. orange and red, we'll call this one complete. I don't think you actually get the item, but uh, we'll call it complete. <laughs> Instructions are on the lectern behind you. Okay, let me. Um, but, oh. Okay, the box. Welcome to the box. To unseal the treasure from the box, you'll need these lanterns lit. But your wits must be sharper than the fox for solving these puzzles. Six. Entering the door to the left will send you to the first puzzle. Once the puzzle is completed, you'll be brought back here, and the lamp shall be lit up. Entering the left door again will take you to the next puzzle, and so on. Warning, do not carry any of the key items as your inventory may be cleared of items for the puzzle. To start, press the button above the lectern. Okay. Button pressed. Going left. <laughs> this one is not exit. complete, so you'll have to use the emergency exit and uh, and press one of the... The ones that is complete. I think they got they had very big ideas and big plans, and I don't think they quite managed to uh, to complete everything. So just orange and red are the only two that are done. Do 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 do. Ah, wrong buttons. Be nice if I remembered how to play Minecraft. <laughs> also, be careful. It is unfortunately possible to punch the frames off of the wall, even in adventure mode. But you can't place them back. If you do, I will put them back for you. If you do it by mistake, but just try not to. Okay. I am. Hi. Uh, following you. I don't know if you... Can you see me at all? No. Okay. That was a guess. Uh, you did, did, you did very right? well. He's looking right at me. Okay. That was creepy. I'm a spooky ghost. You know, it's been so long since I've played this game <laughs> that... I don't know what some of these things... What noises they make. All right. This is my fault for not playing vanilla or, <laughs> well, basically any Minecraft for a very long time, so... I've already tried the fire charge there. I've tried the dragon head there. Um, let's try the puffer fish because, again, I don't know what a puffer fish does. So let's see. Nope. Uh, You're at 12 minutes, by the way. I'm at 12 minutes. Oh, yay. Okay. <laughs> Just keeping you updated. Let's, uh, let's, let's move along. How do I get out of here? Let's get out of here. Because I know what three of them are. I just can't figure out the other ones. Uh, Let's try the orange one. Uh, ding, 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 ding. Left side, right side, barrel match. The game is simple. Just match the pattern from the left side to the right side. There are three rounds. Place the blocks in the top left slot. What? Emergency reset. Round one, iron. Round two, gold. Round three, diamond. You are the sound room person. Jam is the sound room person, Seth. So I can blame Jam for it. But... It is entirely his fault, 100%. Making sure, and I should do that. Yay! Okay, so I completed orange. Mm-hmm. So you've got to go back to red if you want to finish this. I like this better this way. <laughs> Can I just stay this way? I want to stay this way. Okay. Snap the dragon. Uh, 
Stop the magic dragon. Hey, okay. Why? <laughs> Confused. Unless. Chat, I any don't explanation? Know. Dragon's breath, maybe. That one makes no sense whatsoever. Oh, my mer my cursor's off. I had to fix it. It's fixed, or it should be now. It's the sound of a dragon's breath being bottled, says Jim. Uh, okay. What? What does the golden apple have to do with lightning strikes? That was my question, Jim. Or explosions. Or Why does the apple make what? an explosion? It's the sound of a zombie villager being cured with a golden apple. I have never heard that sound because I've never <laughs> cured a zombie villager. So how am I supposed to know that? That's a very obscure sound. Well, brute forcing works. <laughs> uh, yeah, I guess it does. Whose problem is that? Well, Jam, if it goes over an hour, then it's your problem. Because you'll get a zero. Hasn't even started the parkour yet. And when you make a puzzle, you have to consider your audience. Yeah. Although I don't think I specifically said <laughs> the judges would all be super casual players like me. But, you know, you people know me. You should have known. <laughs> I was kidding on that. I figured they didn't know I was going to be doing it. If they knew I was going to be doing it, these would have been very simple puzzles. <laughs> hey. Okay. So the last one was a log for some reason. It was the sound of when you strip a, a log. Oh, uh, I haven't done that either because I haven't played <laughs> vanilla. Or I haven't played since, yeah. All right, so you've now completed the puzzles. Um, I don't think you can okay. actually get the item, but uh, we'll count that one as done. So that's, you get the ladder, and you've got whatever the reward for that one was. Yep. And it and is at 21 and a half minutes now. <laughs> okay. Chicken Saf. Um. Now is this an actual puzzle? This is one of them. Yeah. There is a book there. I think with instructions. Inside one of the other puzzles are some secret Gryffindor house points. Find them and X marks the spot. Okay. Let's go to the next one then. <laughs> Still don't get this one. Um, it may be a part of one of the other ones. Yeah, it looks like it's probably something to do with this. I see a ladder. This must be the parkour one. <laughs> parkour by It's My Cheese. Now, this is a fellow simpleton who has made this one, and um, me and the other judge, who shall be revealed pretty soon, um, have collectively agreed that we need to torture him for having made this. He deserves torture. Okay. Let's see. Shortcut behind the tree if you can't get past the start. Please try it as it was intended first. Arr. <laughs> okay, this is going to take me a moment to get back at this. Dang it. Dang it. Mm. This is not the kind of parkour I normally do. Jim says that... Jim says that glass part is part of the puzzle box. Actually, Jim, um, the this section sends you there. I may just take that uh, shortcut in this moment. <laughs> I tried this part, just, just this first bit, for about 20 minutes before I gave up. And I didn't see the shortcut, so I just didn't finish this one. <laughs> shortcut behind the tree. Where's the shortcut behind the... Oh, yeah, it's right here. Yep. Not even going to bother with it at the moment. Okay, so it would have led up to here, which leads to over there. Dang it. Dang it. Oh. I was doing so well. 
<laughs> Once again, the name is It's My Cheese if you uh, need someone to send hate mail to after this. I will. Uh, yep, yep, I will. <laughs> Normally, I would be okay with this. I think the next event is going to have to be all of the simpletons on one team. It's my cheese and a team by himself, and the patrons on another one. And we're just going to design torture for cheese. I can I can get behind this. Because <laughs> this is by far, I think, the most difficult thing on any of the maps. Sharpie says I can watch Saf falling at parkour all day. Failing at parkour, my bad. Mm, same difference. I'm doing both. Uh, so yeah, close. no, not even close on that one. <laughs> I screwed up before I made the jump, and I knew it, and it was too late. Works better if you jump, Saf. Works better if you jump. East. Oh. Progress was made. Progress was made, and then completely redone. Yes, Phoenix, we know that it's Ow. it's my cheese who created this, and uh, we are already making plans to destroy him. We don't hate the person, we hate the root, says Jim. Yeah, no, no, no. We don't hate cheese. We just need to make him pay for this. That's all. I'll tell you what, we're coming up on 30 minutes now, so I'm going to tell you something that the previous judge figured out. It is okay. possible to cheese cheese's parkour if you know where the goal is. It looks like I need to go that way. Which goes to the top of the tree, then goes over that way. <laughs> Apparently, Mrs. P says you should have kept the elytra and then done the parkour. <laughs> now, that would be cheating, but I would have let you do it. <laughs> yeah, now all you gotta do is not screw up. <laughs> do Well, I don't wanna say anything. <laughs> Run along the glass. Okay. Oh, no! son of a... <laughs> oh, you were so close. Well, you know which way to go now. <sighs> Once again, the name is It's My Cheese. Make sure to jump over the glass wall. You serious? <sighs> I didn't realize until it was too late. <laughs> Nearly there. Nearly there. There's a hole on the other side with the soft landing in it. Oh, I didn't see that. Yeah, it's kind of tough to see if you're not in spectator mode looking down at the map. <laughs> Cheater. I may have a slight advantage. Hey, I did this already. Actually, that's not true. I didn't. I, I spent 20 minutes trying and then I gave up. To be fair, I have a concussion and I was getting very dizzy. And my doctor would be real angry if they knew I was doing this. You shouldn't be doing this. No. I stopped. Yay! <sighs> Figure out... Seriously? Yeah, this part's not nice, because there's basically no information about how to solve it. <laughs> Pirate's asking me if I'm sure this didn't give me the concussion. Um, maybe retroactively. There I'm looking go. for things. <laughs> well done. Jeez. If you if you put the levers in exactly the right position, it moves one of the trap doors as a hint that you can move a trap door, but there's no indication of what position you need to put the levers in. So <laughs> Jam says also big hint don't leave. Oh no, he left. Yeah, Jam, you see the problem with that. 
You do see the problem with that now, right? <laughs> Wait, what? Why was I not supposed to leave? I'm not supposed to say anything. If Jem wants to say something or Phoenix wants to say something, they may. We're at uh, 38 and a half minutes now. And you have two more items to collect or slash challenges to complete. Oh, Phoenix you're, you're, and Jam both say secrets. You're talking about the thing for this. Well, to be quite honest, if you want a casual person to complete puzzles, you don't put secrets all over the place. That's for somebody who is a completionist that's going to take longer than an hour to do something. So, <clears throat> tree trunk, nine and three quarters. But is this a puzzle? So I've got to be back at work at three, uh, at four o'clock. <laughs> okay, saw that. Um, over here, over here. This is absolutely astonishing. It would appear I've been whisked away, or perhaps warped is a more fitting description to a location vastly different to the beginning of my search. This bears more investigation. After a rather limited exploration of this ruin, I have learned of two interesting features. First being a waterfall of lava blocking the path forward, and the second being an odd rectangular protrusion of stone seat in the all of a dead end. I have learned to the first being a waterfall of lava blocking the path forward. Uh, I do believe this part has not reset since the previous judge went through, so you may have a slight advantage. There was a waterfall of lava here. And I still fell in. <laughs> That's amazing. That was actually quite impressive. <laughs> <laughs> da, da. Uh, leather boots with feather falling. Oh, I remember those. This is absolutely a. I think the hint is that the the diamond doors are are blocking your way, and the key is to always put away your tools when you're done with them. Dreamcatcher. Yay. That was item four, one left. Now how much time do I have left? Uh, 16 minutes. Okay, not bad. Now I just gotta find a way into this place. No, I ain't going. Wait, is there a hallway back there? No telling. Uh, Jam says, this doesn't have a path leading to it, so you're in the wrong neighborhood. Not in there. Oh. Okay. Well, this is this big gray thing off in the distance. It caught my attention. So let's see. Pathway here. Yeah, you've done the tree. I don't see any other pathways. There's one that you didn't finish yet. Uh, they, uh... The time one. Phoenix says, put the book back as well. We can deal with that after. So, to complete this one, I had, is the, to complete this one, I need to know the stuff to get in here. I'm confused. Let's go see if there's any more information on this. I have no idea what I'm doing on this one. Except finding numbers in the other puzzles that I've already done and passed. Phoenix says behind paintings are secrets. Oh, that one. That means parkour again. It does mean parkour again. There is Why actually an easier way to choose the parkour. But I don't know if okay, I can well... tell you what it is or... Oh. It Hold is now... 
There are now 12 minutes left. Sorry, 13 minutes left. So maybe I'll ask or Team Orange, how do you feel about me giving Saf a, uh, a hint about how to cheese? Yes, even easier. Hold on one do you second. wanna... There's a risk that he might not finish in the hour. If he... <laughs> well, he probably will. But There is an, I believe, unintended way of cheesing this. Yeah, there probably is. It's probably getting on top of one of these trees, right? Tell him the cheese, says Phoenix. Uh, yeah, you can get you can get on top of... Uh, if you do the little glass wall, again, like you were at the beginning. And then directly ahead of you, to your right, there's a tree yep. which goes over the glass, and you can uh, get on the glass itself from there. Ah, yes. You do have to make it to the tree first. <laughs> Except it's not far enough. Nope, that's not the way. You gotta get on the wall. Oh. Gotta get on this wall? Mm-hmm. From the tree. Oh. I swear, the fact that y'all hid a second puzzle inside of the hardest puzzle in the entire thing, whose idea was that? I do think Team Orange might be a little bit evil. And apparently they were planning on hiding more of these in the other puzzles as well. But I think if they did that, there's no chance anyone would finish it in an hour. Uh -huh. Phoenix says that uh, he was going to hide points in some of the other ones and you would only need one of them. So you wouldn't necessarily have to do the parkour if he had been able to finish. Which would have been a little bit more reasonable. And I still don't know what I'm doing when I get over there. <laughs> I'll, I'll talk you through it, because otherwise you're going to go over the hour, and it would be a shame after all their hard work for them to get a zero. <laughs> all right. So I got to get on that tree. Yeah, on that tree, the same tree that you were on. You did that part right. And then instead of going down, walk along the top of the glass wall. Don't go down oh. into where the slime is. Go around it and just go directly to the second hole. I get it now. I should have thought of that. My brain is not working in that direction at the moment. Thank you. You're welcome. Uh, behind uh, Jan, the time is now 51 and 40 seconds. So he's got... Oh, look what you found. Good about job. About eight and a half this minutes left. A little over eight minutes left. Ten points. Don't push the button. <laughs> yeah, I wasn't going to. <laughs> oh, goodness. That would have been terrible. I was looking. So accessing that painting has made it where I can do a thing. Uh, okay. Okay. <laughs> Originally, this had sand over it because somebody forgot that this was going to be an adventure mode and not a uh, survival mode. So that's it. You did it. So I will stop the timer. Yay! Orange map complete. <laughs> Your time is 53 minutes and 13 seconds. Uh... I'm going to write that down. And you are now free of this map. And we can go and join the blue one. I think I got a little too frustrated on that one. I just oh, straight up hard. rage quit when I did it, so... <laughs> <laughs> uh, again, step on the button to make sure you're in, in adventure mode. And they even added a food button. Done. Fancy, fancy folk that they are. Yeah, I have food now. And um, right. I am going to go to the next area before you step on that gold button because it's on the other side of the map, and I want to be able to record it. Okay. So you tell me. Or hold on one second, and then I'm going to start. I also have to start the timer. But this one will not take the full hour. I can pretty much guarantee, unless you really, really get stuck. So, are you ready? I am ready. All right, I'm going to count you in. Three, two, one, start. You may begin. I have landed on the gold thing. I am in darkness. Slime, I hunger. Bring me another mill. Okay. Ah! <laughs> what are you doing? Why am I being attacked? I do believe you are intended to be the meal. <laughs> oh, no. 
He died. Well, hello there. Welcome to the afterlife. Bad news, you're dead. But the good news is now I can raise you to help me. Who am I? I am the Lich Queen, mistress of undeath. And I need you to f kill that foul upstart prince, my brother. Okay. Then we'll do that. And I have a bone. He has hidden magical components behind challenges to keep himself immune from damage. Fake immortality. I need you to gather them all in Ozmad. Yeah. With my magic, I can summon the first of these artifacts to you. Your journey begins at the highest of highs. I will summon your new body there. Uh, okay. <laughs> all right, hold Safe on a second. Point. I got to come over to you now. <laughs> I don't get to warp around the map. So they clearly, uh, they, they went with sort of a story for this one, which is very cool. I see that. All right, I'm here. You may proceed when ready. Okay. Um, I feel like I'm supposed to jump in here. Mm -hmm. And then eat some more food. Because I'm scared. And I already <laughs> have the xylophone. I don't know how that happened. I think uh, they give you that one for free in this one as well. Okay. Or, yeah, I think the fire eyes person... I didn't know that's what one. kind of puzzle that was, and now I know. <laughs> okay. Yeah, it's a dropper. I've never done a dropper in, uh, wow. in Minecraft before. And I'm guessing I was supposed to land somewhere else. Yeah, that's exactly the same thing that I did the first time. You will bounce Lucky. off of the uh, slime and land somewhere else. Oh, dear. <laughs> <laughs> Only if I can do the dropper. I've never done one in <laughs> Minecraft before, so I, I, I'm bad at this. It's not too bad. I mean, you made it to the bottom. You just have to uh, move to the side. Yeah, there you go. That's it. That's the entire dropper. However, the next part is probably the most challenging part of this map. However, this group was less evil. Uh, except there are. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and tell you this right now, just to to keep you from getting too stressed. There are save points in this part, so if you keep going from where you were, you'll get to a, a save point, and you won't have to do that part again. Watch this end up being the one that I take forever, ah, forever on. If Dang you it. keep going around the corner, oh. If you manage to get around the corner fast enough, there's a save a save point button, and you won't have to do that part again. I got stuck in the lava. I saw. It took me a lot of tries to get past that part. You're not alone. I'm still on fire. Well, that's not ideal. Nice. If you turn around and look behind you. Oh, okay. You're going to want that. This map, uh, it's, it's another parkour map, it's not as hard as the other one, and there are generous save points, so I found it much less frustrating. <sighs> it does still start with fence posts, though. <laughs> Which is a little evil. Yes, this is very evil. Very evil. Not I'm not sure evil. who built very this part, evil. actually. Is the builder of this parkour map in the audience right now? I guess maybe not. This is evil. This is evil. <laughs> it's, it's a lot less evil than uh... Jesus, Matt. Oh, I didn't... Ooh. Fine, I'll just skip that one then. <laughs> uh... You can do it, Seth. No, I can't. You can. <laughs> <laughs> you, you're great at jumping. It's the landing that's killing you. Yes, the landing. Almost at it. So are you like right there? Hi. Pretty much, yeah. Hi, how you doing? <laughs> <laughs> it's like you're doing well. I'm doing really well. You're doing great. 
Entertainment for the masses. Watch Seth die in lava repeatedly. You should change your stream title. Stream title changed. <laughs> nice. If you can get across to that button, that button's another checkpoint. Yeah, uh, see? That almost got me. <laughs> I think the biggest trick with this one is how well the fences blend in with the walls. So you said that was the save point? Yeah. If you press the button, then you are saved. I do think they should have put signs next to them to make it clear that they're save points and not traps, but... Fortunately, all of the buttons and pressure plates in here are save points. And they're actually quite generous. You usually don't have to go too far to get one. I think the first one is probably the hardest, so... Now where? Pirate would have rage quit by now. <laughs> If you can get on the button, you can say, oh no. Very I close. I didn't know that it would, they, they changed the way the lava worked at that point. Uh, so. I thought I was going to sink deeper. Nice. Nice. Button. This is a tricky one here. But it is possible. Oh, there's a block there. I didn't yeah. even see. <laughs> they all blend in together really well. It's tough to see. You almost had it that time. Uh. <laughs> no, let me get to the ladder. Saf is taking a lot of hot baths, says Gadget Girl. Yeah, yeah, I am. I'm okay. I'm so confused. Wouldn't let me jump. Just can't keep okay. Saf out of the so sauna. Get here first. Yay! <sighs> I don't even know how I did it, but okay. Doesn't matter. He did it. Now the ladders of doom. Whoever made this section is twisted. You should have seen the parkour in the previous map. <laughs> that was twisted. Nice. First try. <sighs> You're near the end now. I don't know. I'm beginning to think that the parkour from the other one would be easier than this. You think? Except for the lack of a... Yeah. Oh my goodness. Now that I'm getting used to doing the fence posts. There's a button behind you, by the way. Huh. I found this one a lot easier, but I think it's probably to do with the save points more than anything. Yeah, the save points are the, the saving grace on this one. Because after 20 minutes on the, the other one, I couldn't even complete the first section. Helpful item. Helpful so even items. save points wouldn't have helped me. Potion of fire resistance. And helpful hints. What you seek is through the fire, but the exit lies below. Okay. can't see a thing, so I'm hoping I'm going in the right direction. <laughs> I shall say nothing. Oh, come on. <sighs> I'll, uh, I'll, I'll suggest trying, uh, reading the hint again. You get, like, three minutes of fire resistance. What you seek is through the fire, but the exit lies below. Right. So what you seek is... Through the fire. the fire. It's Trixie. 
It took me a few minutes to figure out what the hint meant. Yay! Okay. Now you can leave. Jump quick, good luck. Okay. Man, am I the only one who didn't figure this part out? <laughs> I actually missed this entire part of the map. Because when I jumped down, I went to the side. And landed in the river. So I didn't even know that this maze was here. <laughs> okay. And I didn't get one of the items. Are you hugging the right? Right is always right. <laughs> I'm gonna possess you. There we go. I'm still I'm looking through your eyes now. Oh, we're at twenty minutes, by the way. Okay. I got two of the items. This is gonna give me motion sickness like crazy. <laughs> In case anyone is wondering, um, to complete a maze, all you need to do is always hug the right hand side. And it may take longer. Um than like trying to figure it out from a bird's eye view, but I don't have a bird's eye view. If you do that, it will always lead to the exit. Almost always. If it's a really complicated maze with loops in the middle, then it doesn't necessarily work. Yeah, Crunk's saying the same thing. It only works if there's no loops. Yeah. And Sharpie says no that was always hug the left. I always hug the left, but yeah, as long as you pick one side and stay the same and there's no loops in the maze, then it's fine. Yay. Okay, my doubloon. I can leave now. Okay. Reach the other side of the map before the time runs out. Step on the plate to begin. Failure means a return here to start. Okay. I have to say, I really liked this section. I don't know who built this Next. one, but I thought it was very fun. All right. Really? Thank you. Watch out for the buttons. <laughs> oh, I don't know where I'm supposed to go. You're going the right way. There's only one way you can go. Uh, oh, okay. actually, that's not true. They didn't fence this area off. They should have. Oh, well, that's just rude. Probably forgot. Oh, son of a... <laughs> son of a monkey's uncle. No. Everyone Damn. hits that button. <laughs> that one's mean. Why is my ping so bad? Loading terrain. Is my internet being a poop again? Well, now, I now have a sea fire candle. Yay. And you left the game. You did that quickly. Okay, here we go. I think my internet must have been messed up for a bit there. I am back in. Where are you? Seek the treasure of the cave, but beware you can't always walk in the light. Okay. I don't know what this button does. So okay. I'm going to click on it again just to make and sure. I'm back with you. Dangerous to go alone. Okay. I have a bow. Go get rid of the stuff. Sword. And arrows. Okay. Do, do, do. Off we go. With 106 ticks to spare, said Gadget Girl. <laughs> uh oh, Save Creeper! Point. Creeper! <laughs> Shouldn't have warned you. But I did. Is that Creeper normally there? Uh, that mobs like a... just spawn normally in the dark. Oh no! Dang. No, I had a, a tough safe zombie. Point. 
It's a baby zombie. They're always tough. Yeah, I hate them. Wait, did you spawn back at the start? The save point didn't work. Yeah, I noticed that. Hmm. There you go. That's one way to kill him. Oh, he didn't die. He landed in water. Ah! <laughs> that works. Maybe that's what they mean by save point. Stand here to save your life. Nothing more useful than a golden sword, huh? Exactly. Holy heck. <laughs> well, you've got a bow and arrows. You might want to use I them. I want to go in there. there. Do, 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 do. Any more save points? Save points would be nice. <laughs> yeah, they really skimped on the save points on this one, huh? I'm guessing that's a save point. Nope, it's the end. Oh. Take only one. Please close gate before leaving. Okay. It's already closed. There's an exit button. There you go. Yeah, I just wanted to make sure I wasn't missing anything. Since, you know, other people like for me to do stuff. All right. I am Kitty possessing table. you again, by the way. I figure I should let you know. And you're also at 30 minutes now. Okay. You gave me a sword. Am I supposed to take that? Yep. Okay. Xylophone. See fire candle and dream gutter. I could have used all those whenever I was first going through this thing. That would have been partially useful. <laughs> well, you have them now. Do not enter unless prepared. Okay. Boss fight. I mean, I could go that way. I wouldn't recommend it. I'm pretty sure somebody <laughs> forgot to block this up. <laughs> oh, it's you again? Yay! <laughs> That's it. <laughs> I will stop the timer. Yeah. So your total time is 31 minutes and 12 seconds. And yeah, this one was definitely away. quicker. Yeah. A little bit less evil. <clears throat> Yes. And uh, feel uh, free well, to grab no, a book and write no. your time and put it in the chest there. They have set that up nicely. Fine. Whatever. <laughs> what were you trying to write? There we go. That'll work. Does that work for you guys, chat? We'll go with that. <laughs> <laughs> Mad at parkour? <laughs> yeah, I didn't like it, but... it. It, it wouldn't it wouldn't fit so now i have no like uh. jump <laughs> that works so, uh, so um irova 99 blocks and saffron okay that's cool. the three judges so the judging is done after after this i will uh, i'll go through and tally up the, the scores and everything like that